so this is a Japan haul video. Today I'm gonna show you guys everything I bought from my first Japan trip. And please bear with me because my, all my stuff are anime stuff. Okay, so first starting off with the anime merch. First, I have this weekly Shonen Jump magazine. I think it's the 25th issue. So I bought this because I just wanted to experience buying a manga magazine in Japan because I've always read manga online or from their comic books but never from the magazine. So yeah, I just wanted to experience it. And the second reason is because Lucy is on the cover. He's my favorite character ever. And I was so happy at the fact that when I was in Japan, the cover just happened to be Luffy. And it's not only Luffy, it's Luffy sitting on a throne. How cool is that? Yes. If you're curious about how the magazine is like on the inside, it looks like this. It's really giving us people vibes. And then I bought a pair of Dolphy socks. I don't know why I bought this, but yeah. And then I got this one piece echo bag. I just thought that I needed at least one useful thing, so I decided to buy this. Then I got this Anya and Bondo file or paper holder. I don't know what it's called, but yeah. Ta -da! Next, I got this Yuji and Todo picture. This is taken from the scene where Yuji uses black flash for the first time, and I think this is one of my most favorite items because. It's not a painting, I'm pretty sure it's printed, but it's on a canvas, so I think this is really cool. And also, they are my favorite duo, so yeah, this is my most favorite purchase. And then I got these glow in the dark stickers. This one is a Sabo Luffy, and this one is Luffy and Shanks. And I think it is supposed to look like this. Next, I have this mini one piece puzzle. It looks like this. It's a bit random, but I think I got this from Big Camera. And then I got this Shanks Wanted poster paper clip. At first, I thought it was a pin, but I was wrong. And then I got this Luffy Wanted poster magnet. I actually bought this one at the Narita airport because I couldn't find any in all the jump shops that I visited and at Narita airport they actually have all these straw hats and I regret not buying the others and then I got this sack of cards honestly I don't really know what exactly it is so let's just open it Oh, so I think these are just profile cards. It shows the basic profile information like this. And the set that I bought, it includes Luffy, Zoro, Sanji, and Shanks. I actually love this because it's a real card and not just, you know, paper. Next, I got this Baji Kanbeige because he's my favorite character from Tokyo Revengers. And then I also picked up some random blind boxes. Uh, not boxes, you know what I mean. <laughs> this random stuff. So I'm gonna open them now. Let's start off with this Jujutsu keychain. Popping for Yuji, but... Next, I forgot what it is. Let's just open it. Ah! 
What am I a number of magnet? So it's another keychain. Uh, next, this one is one piece, but I forgot what it is. Ah, I get Zoro! Yay! It's Zoro with an ice cream. So cute! Next, another keychain, but I think this one is only a name. Let's see what it is. why but even though it's only a name it just looks so cool next i have three can pages i'm gonna open this Luffy! ah it's blue it's blue ah frankie why am i not getting any luffy i want luffy please this one be luffy everything I got from the random blind packages and last I also got this uh, mini wanted poster and a point card from Mugiwara store so basically you will get stamps every time you purchase for certain amounts and when you complete these stamps on one card you will get this one wanted poster so if i complete all the stamps on zoro card then i can get a zoro wanted poster just a quick reminder that mugiwara store is different from jump shops because mugiwara store is a special store that sell one piece merch only now moving on to pokemon stuff first i have this bulbasaur cup i think it's a cup but i didn't get this from the pokemon center i got this from buying a drink at the universal studios and then i have this norlax coaster you can only buy this if you have a reservation at the pokemon cafe and from the pokemon cafe i also got these three coasters that you will get randomly when you buy drinks and then i also have these two stickers a keychain i think i forgot about it and then i also got this raichu coin pocket it's so cute you can put it on your back like a keychain and last i also bought a pikachu plushie it's so cute because it's lying down kawaii ne next moving on to my gacha items i actually didn't play that many during my Japan trip and I honestly regret it so much so my advice is if you are in Japan so every has to let to play gacha because you will not find that many gacha machines anywhere else so yeah you just gotta waste your money on gacha while you can first I got this Pokemon I know the Pokemon but I don't remember its name Next, I have this Raichu. I got this Raichu figure. Next, I got this Pokemon Cafe menu. I was hoping to get the menu that I ordered, which is the Eve one, but I got the Pikachu one. Oh, no, no, not this one. I got this one. I got this Himeno keychain and then a Lipton Melty keychain. I bought this because Wono drank this when he was in Japan. <laughs> Next, I got this 
Maki Keychain and this last two I played it in Narita Airport so it was really a last minute gacha I got Mikey so this is Tokyo Revenger sleeping figure it's so cute and last it's still the same figure but I got Chibuyu I was really hoping to get Baji but I didn't and I already ran out of coins too so so that's it for my Japan haul thank you all for watching